Is this heaven? No, it's Wuhan. Good morning. Good morning from Wuhan, China. My name is Jesse. Thanks for joining me on this walk today by the Yangtze River. Hope you enjoy the video. I got an email from my friend. She said, are you nestled in? And I thought, what a perfect phrase, a perfect way of putting what I'm doing. Nestled in, it conjures up so many wonderful images. A bird sitting comfortably in its nest. Anyone just settling in, maybe on the, on the sofa with a loved one, just comfortable doing nothing. I love that term. And yeah, that's, that's the appropriate term for me in Wuhan, China for these next seven weeks. Well, I say next. For a total of seven weeks, two weeks have already passed since I've arrived. And yeah, I'm, I'm nestled in. And it's a really good jumping off place for what I want to mainly talk about in this video, which is, well, it's, it's based on another saying. Have you heard this one? Life is not a dress rehearsal. This is it. We only have one shot at this thing. Make the most of it if you can. On the other hand, I believe in rehearsal. I, I really believe in rehearsal. I've talked before about leap and a net will appear. And uh, that's what I've done so many times in my life, but I've always done the preparation beforehand. And that's what I mean by the rehearsal. And right now, as I'm nestled into, uh, you know, my quiet summer in Wuhan, China, with my wife's summer, I am, I'm kind of rehearsing for the next stage in my life. I'm not quite retired, although I feel retired at many, <laughs> in many moments. But I, I think it's important to get a feel for well, in addition to the finances, which I've talked about before and we'll talk about again, about really what I will do. What'll I, what'll I do with myself with all these hours? I know I won't be doing that, although that's exactly what my, my father-in-law does here in China. He plays the tuba and he's always down here in this park somewhere, this park by the Yangtze River on weekends, playing with his lifelong buddies. Another aspect uh, of that term nestled in that I liked from my friend was that it's, it's different than, um, I don't know, vacation travel. I arranged this trip with a week in Thailand at the beginning and then uh, seven weeks with summer here in Wuhan. Actually not all here in Wuhan because the last week uh, we will go to Guizhou to um, hill villages with, um, you know, minority people's culture, and uh, that will be really cool. But these, I guess these six weeks sandwiched in between, am I on vacation? Am I re rehearsing for a time when I'll have nothing to do? Mostly I'm just 
cherishing the time I have with Summer. Unfortunately for her, well, for both of us, she is working. Her school semester runs. Uh, she'll be working until the third week of June. Right now it is, I guess, the fourth week of May. So I have a lot of hours in between when she gets up to go to work in the morning and when she comes home. What do I do? If I tell you, when I tell you, there's a, there's a very high probability that you'll say, what a freaking boring life. Get a life. But to quote the band Talk Talk, it's my life. Don't you forget. A little dilemma for me up ahead, video-wise. I want to catch these men, possibly retired guys, doing what? Maybe playing poker? But at the same time, can you hear it in the background? The inevitable, disturbing, grass-cutting men. God bless them. It looks like the table's out, but the cards are not out yet. It's talk talk time. It's their life. Meanwhile, these poor sods. Hot Sunday morning. Working like dogs. And I'll tell you, they're not that young, which is a sad reality. Fortunately, I don't have a problem with boredom. I'm good solo. I always have ways to fill up my time, even if it seems like I'm doing very little. One thing is it, it's a major time suck to walk, to walk as much as I do. I set a goal for this month, which was 16,000 steps a day. And I generally range in between, uh, you know, 12 and 18,000 steps. And that shit takes time. Sometimes when I'm walking, I'm also doing a video, which is another thing that uh, I've been wanting to ramp up this summer. So videos, thinking them out, editing them later, that takes time as well. Luckily for me, I hit this trip during NBA playoffs season. I am a huge basketball fan, or scratch that, a huge NBA basketball fan. It used to be my, my job, my career, covering NBA basketball, and it's, it's a passion of mine. And so I have been watching the playoffs for the past month or so, virtually every day. How many of you, how many of you, how many of you out there can say that you have watched 90% of the playoff games this season? I'm, uh, I'm guessing few, but I have. And now that I'm in Asia and uh, here in China, a uh, 7.30 game, which will start at 7.40, will begin at 7.40 in the morning for me. So get up. Get some breakfast and coffee, crank up the laptop, watch NBA basketball. So, you know, maybe three hours of walking, two hours of watching basketball. That's a big chunk of the work day. What are these guys doing? Kites.
another retirement hobby that is not mine, but they seem to enjoy it. And that's all that matters. What else? I read, read books, read the news, listen to podcasts. Um, right now, I am re-watching the Morse detective television series. I'm doing that because concurrently, I am introducing Summer to Endeavor, Young Morse. And uh, we have just started season two, and that's what we do uh, probably half of our evenings. I'm gonna do a little panorama, so hold on to your dizziness hats. And then, of course, various and sundry other things. Today, Summer and I are going to the theater. We're going to watch a, um, a dance program based on the poems of Tang Dynasty poet Du Fu. Uh, this dance show is about the famous uh, poet Du Fu in China. Um, People have a nickname for him, which is the, how to say, poem tree. Uh, okay, okay, poem tree of history. <laughs> because um, his poems are about um, the society of uh, Tang Dynasty, or actually um, the time where he lived. Uh, when he lives, uh, when he lived, was the turning point of Tang Dynasty from a very fabulous and excellent <laughs> an excellent uh, country from uh, to a broken one so uh, it's very how to say dramatic so people um, people made this uh, dance show according to the work the works of uh, Du Fu uh, four different uh, sections of his whole life uh, led us to see um, okay. okay we know that okay <laughs> and what uh, where, 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 where was that well And I'll tell you one thing that I am not doing. I am not preparing for the fall semester at the University of Pitt. I think classes will start either late August or early September. Nah, I've done this long enough and I've adopted an attitude, not quite quiet quitting, but something like that as a part-time adjunct instructor. I've done this a lot of years. I know what I'm doing, good at it, students like me, yeah, not going to waste time preparing for something I can do well. And to be honest, this is a, uh, a new attitude for me. In previous years, I would just prepare work in my free time too much, whether it was a full-time job or a part-time job, I would just spend too much time on it compared to, well, compared to what I need to, compared to um, how it improves the class, compared to how 
they're paying me. Yeah, so there it is. I talked about that in a video from Thailand a couple weeks ago, how I'm not very ambitious and less so as I move to this totally relaxed stage of my life. Well, not totally relaxed. My mind, my mind still goes in circles. As the kids say, not gonna lie. As the kids say, pretty sure that this is the first time in my life that I've ever said that. And I said it kind of, uh, yeah, self-mockingly, a joke for myself. Hope you enjoyed it. Is this heaven? No, it's Wuhan. At some point, I'm gonna fill up my life with other stuff. In, uh, in my younger days, I was all about snow skiing, playing golf, playing basketball, had some knee problems, moved on. That's why I'm a big walker. Stupid knee preventing me from basically running. But you adjust, right? You see the situation and then you adjust. And I found out that walking is my, it's my jam. I love it. Thinking, walking, seeing. For now, I am going to end this video. I wanna thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. If you liked this video, please press the like button. Drop a comment below. And finally, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, subscribe. Till next time, catch you later.